Hello YouTube, it's your girl Kimberly. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. In this video, it is going to be a Sephora haul. So I have all these things that I got from Sephora. I'm going to show you guys what I got, what I'm really excited about, um, all the different things I want to try. So if you want to see more, keep watching. Alright, so before we get into the video, I just want to remind you guys, hit the subscribe button. That way you won't miss out on any of the great videos that I make here on this channel. Whether it be tech, beauty, skincare, hair care, nail care, all kinds of things. Definitely all the product reviews that you can ever imagine. <laughs> and then hit the notification bell. That way you'll be the first to know when I post a new video or when I go live. So let's get into the haul. So um, as you guys can see compared to my other videos, we real close up in this video. That way you guys can see the products better. So I'm trying something different. So let's see what happens if this works out. Okay. First things first, the things that I'm, I'm excited about everything I bought, but this is like the less exciting stuff. So this is the Tweezer, Tweezer Man Smooth Finish Facial Hair Remover. So basically it is like a little coil that you like rub back and forth on your face and it removes the hair. We're going to see if this works. Um, I do have the Derma Blade thing to shave my face, but I have so much facial hair that I feel like I want to do something else first and then that way the derma plane can get really close to my skin instead of just shaving so I got this for that reason um next thing I got uh this is gonna be interesting how I do this because I'm like where am I gonna put the stuff um on my lap okay next thing I got was the drop quick clean dry clean sephora brush instant brush cleaner so basically you're supposed to be able to just spray this on your brush and then it automatically cleans it in an instant so um although i do clean my brushes often as i can um i definitely sometimes like to reach for the same eyeshadow brush because it's like my fave and it might not be all the way clean from the last time i used it so this uh spot clean spray is really going to help me out Okay, next, we have Sephora Pro Brush number 20. So this is a, um, a brow brush, pro brow brush. So it's an angled brush at one end, and then it has a spoolie at the other end. So when you see the products I got, it'll make sense why I got this brush. Um, next, I got another Sephora collection item. This is the Refresh and Prep Lip Scrubber Exfoliating Brush, basically. So it's a little scrubby brush that you just scrub on your lips. Um, the mask have been destroying my lips. I have to like keep chapstick on my lips 24-7. Between the winter cold air and the mask life, my lips are just lips struggling out here. So that is that. Okay. So that is all the Sephora collection stuff I got. So now we're going to get into the product product. Okay, so... We already got into the different um, Sephora collection stuff, so let's get into the products I got. I was really excited about the makeup, milk makeup, what do you call these things? The milk makeup electric glossy lip plumper. So this is the shade Buzzed. And then this is the shade Charged. So I'm really excited about these. They are lip glosses and they were $25 each. I love Milk Cosmetics products. Um, like I said, lip gloss is my thing now because of the dry lips. So let's see. I think I'm really going to be excited about those. Speaking of lip glosses, another lip gloss that I got was the Anastasia Beverly Hills Crystal Lip Gloss. So basically a clear lip gloss because I have the one with the little glitter flex in it. But I wanted the plain one to see what that was like. So um, Anastasia Beverly Hills, another lip gloss. Just released Huda Beauty um bomb brows micro shade brow pencil so these are going to be really interesting to try especially since i prefer a thick brow and i don't have one in real life i wasn't born with it so i'm really excited to try these two out i got the shades black brown and rich brown so the, they had a black shade as the darkest shade i try not to do black brows but um i got the two darkest brown shades as you can see so here let me put them close to the camera so that way you can see the difference they're really close can you you're not can you see oh there you go that's gonna be better so they're really close in shade like one's just warm tone and one's cool tone but um I tend to do like the beginning of my brows warm tone and then the end will be more cool tone if I do two different shades so 
Next thing I'm really excited about, the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Free Styling Wax. Everybody has been singing the praises of this thing. So that's why I got the angled brush with the little spoolie because I'm going to use that to apply it. And I'm excited to see if hopefully this might be the trick to maybe me using less brow products. I love overloading the brow so I cannot promise that but I might, this might help that out. And then the last thing in the haul was a uh, Laneige lip glowy balm um this is one of my favorite lip products i go between this and the um fenty beauty uh lip balm i go between those two but this one is my favorite because it has the plastic tip instead of the doe foot applicator so i really like that so um had to re-up and get another one so that's pretty much it for the real quick haul just wanted to share that with you guys and um if you guys have any products that you're interested in or that you're looking to get or if you want to see a review of anything I'm definitely going to do a review for the Huda Beauty um which we call it the eyebrow pencil so that's coming soon but um definitely know let me know what products you're looking at what you're interested in getting if you're getting any makeup right now if you think all this stuff is the same as stuff that already exists let me know how you feel in the comments below all right so I will see you in the next video bye